Hi guys, and welcome to another awesome episode of the Pimp Weekly Wrap. I'm Yana. We have all the news for you this week, and be sure to stay tuned for two super quick reviews of CSGO and Darksiders 2. Kojima said some time ago that he was working on Metal Gear Solid 5. And now there are confirmations from all over the industry from actors who have been performing motion capture for the game. The word is right now that the game will be out for release next year, but we suspect it could be much later than that. This week is all about Metal Gear's 25th birthday, and we expect some big announcements for the franchise and for Kojima. But more on that next week. There is just something that's so special about a brand new IP. And Dishonored is one that sure does get the juices flowing. Due out in a little under two months, Dishonored is shaping up to be one of the more exciting releases this holiday season. We've gushed over Dishonored before, so hop on the bandwagon and check out the new stealth trailer. Sneaky sneaky. Medium range, enemies will see you if you're in their field of view. Huh? What the fuck? However, at a distance, darkness can function as an effective cloak. Gotta be here somewhere. Counter-Strike Global Offense is Valve's latest iteration of the famous Counter-Strike series. It combines the classic gameplay with improved visuals. The biggest issue gamers had with the previous Counter-Strike source was the imperfect hitboxes which have been moderately improved in the latest release. The game is just as fun as ever though, while the formula stays pretty much the same. If you're eliminated at the start of the game, still expect to wait while the rest of your team flails about without you. And expect a ton of pressure if you're the only one left on your team desperately trying to make your way to the bomb. Counter-Strike has maintained its point of difference to other modern shooters such as Battlefield or Call of Duty by making the player work harder for the kill. If you want to perfect your headshots, we recommend CSGO on any platform. Better graphics, loot, faster combat and a bigger world to explore all awaits gamers in Darksiders 2. A direct continuation of the Darksiders story, you play as Death who is out to save his brother, War, which you may remember from the first game. While the formula is familiar and the incorporation of the loot is a great bonus, Darksiders 2 doesn't stray too far from the first game. If you really love the original Darksiders, chances are then you will freaking love this as well. However, if you are left a little bit frustrated with the game's constant kickbacks of objectives, don't expect Darksiders 2 to be any different. I mean, seriously, how many times do we have to prove our worth? Check out Darksiders 2 if you are interested, and if you love the first game, you will sure love the much faster and deeper sequel. Well, that's it for this week, gamers. Be sure to head on over to pimp.tv for all the news, trailers, and reviews you need to get through the week. Follow us on Twitter at PimpTV, and don't forget to like our Facebook page as well. Hit us up next week where we'll have more news and trailers, and let us know in the comment section below what you think of any of the stories from this week's wrap. Bye for now.